You may think it's funny, but I was actually the last person to see them alive last summer. There was only seven in the world and the zoo had four of them. I used to walk there every night just to watch them stand so still in the water. And they walked so graceful in slow motion. And they had legs as skinny as my little finger. Long legs. And there's only seven in the world because they kill them for feathers, for ladies' hats or something. And one night, a gang of boys came by with radios to their ears and cursing real bad. You know, F and everything. And I was scared, you know? And they started saying things to me. You know, dirty things. And laughing at the birds. And one boy threw a stone to see how close he could splash the birds. And then another kid tried to see how close he could splash the birds. And then they all started throwing stones to splash the birds. But then they started throwing at the birds. And I started screaming, stop it! And one stone hit a bird's leg and it bended like a straw. And the birds keeled over, flapping wings in the water. But the kids, they kept laughing and throwing stones and I kept screaming, stop it, stop it. But they couldn't hear me through the ugly music on the radios and kept laughing and throwing stones. And so I ran. I ran and got the zoo guard and he got his club and we ran back to the place of the birds. But the kids were gone. And there's white feathers on the water. The water was real still. And there were big swirls of blood. And the birds were real still. Their beaks a little open. Legs broke. Toes curled. Still. Like the world stopped. And the zoo guard, he was saying something to me, but I couldn't hear him. I just saw his mouth moving. And I started screaming. Then the cops came and he took me to the hospital. And they gave me a needle to make me stop screaming. And they never caught the gang. But even if they did, what good's that? They can't make the birds come alive again. <laughs>